Oops. Hi, sorry, I'm not very good at this. I'm just trying to show you here another website that I've found um, about this um, possible 13th sign being in Orion. Now, the other thing that I showed you earlier, or tried to explain earlier, was about the 13th sign being Arachne, the spider. But I found this website here, and sorry I'm a bit all over the place with this, but I'm trying to do this as well as live a normal life. <laughs> Oh dear. as far as possible so um, this is strdu.com forward slash constellations html but this is very interesting because there's another another name of the 13th sign here which I can't pronounce um, oh dear and I don't know how to make this thing go down here we go right so you can look this website up but it's going on about why we've only got 12 signs and uh, and all the rest of it, sun through the constellations, comparison of astrological and astronomical maps of the zodiac, and then it gets really interesting because it passing through the ecliptic 12 constellations, as well as through this is what I can't um, pronounce it's Ophiuchus Ophi or something. And the ecliptic will also include Orion in a century or so. Now that's interesting when you go down here. Uh, it actually puts Orion there, look, in between Taurus and Gemini, which is exactly where the other people that were saying that's the 13th sign and the other signs I've found, Arach Arachne, is also placing it. So I would like to show you all the other uh, websites that I've found. I don't think I'll be able to. I'll put them on the links of the other video. But this is quite interesting as well. I'll read you this. It says, the Son of Man in the Gospels can be traced to the constellation Orion, which represents Jesus' spirit. Daniel 7, 13-14 describes, describes Jesus quite well, going on about um, that which I'll let you read if you want to. Um, and here we go, even Revelations 22, I don't want to go on about Revelations, it's, it's just connotations of doom and gloom. But interesting, interesting, I'll let you read it all because... I'm sure you can read it here. Here's another fascinating thing. The river of water of life, clear as crystal, is the Milky Way, which runs under the feet of Ophi of Cus, whatever it's called, and over the outstretched arm of Orion. Ah, interesting stuff, folks. So, I, I don't know. I, I, think there's, I think some more research has got to be done on this. I'm sorry that I'm not very good at IT and research. Um, good at waffle. Anyway... Anyway, food for thought, people. Thank you very much. Bye.